Hey, what's up YouTube? Luke the Window Cleaner, Rihanna. We're doing another uh, Q&A here and we're gonna put in some fun comments and uh, we have a few shout outs at the end of the video. And we'll also get to uh, what our t-shirts are about too at the end of the video. So, here we go. Okay, Sunshine Window says, not an attack, but I have watched a couple of your how-to videos and I'm wondering if you have any formal training. Four question marks. Especially when it comes to using scrapers and different types of glass. Well, sunshine windows, let's let's get to the formal training. Actually, I do have formal training and I brought the proof. This is my certificate of achievement. Uh, it was for formal training in the arts of squeegees. And this was presented to me by Peter Parker in 1985 by the best window school in the world. And when it comes to the uh, razor technique, it's flawless, check it out. Super squeegee. I'm interested to know how you manage all your calls. I saw the headset, so do you answer all calls right away or do you wait till the end of the day to catch up? We answer them right away unless we're in front of a customer and then we'll call them back as soon as we can afterwards. Heisenbergers. Good rhythm, the third inside pane at the bottom needed to be mopped better at a minute 38 in your video. Dark glasses equal more speed because you can't see mistakes. That is a very specific thing you just pointed out. And if you're curious where I get those glasses, I bought them at Target for $5.99. Like $12. $12, it'll make you faster. Picking Paul what? My sister's the best window cleaner I've ever worked with. Good for you, bud. Right on, man. Siblings. <laughs> hey, Zeus, Christmas self. Does that tool belt come with a tampon dispenser? No, we keep ours in the glove box. Both, both of ours. Yeah. Yeah. Sarah C says, nice video, girl power. Need more females on the industry. I enjoy your videos, guys. Sarah likes cats. CNC Window Cleaning LLC. I love it. There's a few of my original ideas in this video, like the paint can opener for extracting screens. Not saying you got them from me. Oh. CNC and D Window Cleaning. CNC. Oh, CNC. I'm sorry. CNC and C Window Cleaning. Original ideas. So, guys, the search is over. We all know what this is, and we all, I think most window cleaners use this, but um, I have been searching since I began this trade back in 1974 to find out who hacked the paint can opener to make it into a screen extractor tool, and the search is over. We have found the guy. It is, uh, I think his name's Ralph for Scott or Ryan over at CNC Window Cleaning. That's awesome, man. Okay, so this is the uh, accelerator video. Uh, Amoroso asks, is this better than the wagtail flip? Should I wait for these to hit the US or just get the wagtail flip? The accelerator handle is better than the wagtail handle, in my opinion. It has a lot of different features. Um, two of my favorite that the wagtail does not is how the pad is attached to the tool. You will not have to modify that. The pad, uh, the, the way that the, the Mormon has attached the pad to the tool is fantastic and the idea of being able to change uh, degrees on the tool is also um, one of the best additions that I've seen in a long time to any tool. All right, I have a few shout outs and then we're gonna get to our shirts. I think there was a guy named Keith. Um, he's got like a small YouTube channel. Kelpis, I think it's Keith Kelpis. Keith, Keith Kelp, Keith, Keith Kelpis. Um, he's got a great channel. If you guys want to check him out, I'll leave a link in the description below. Aaron over at what what once was um, five, star. five Star Window Cleaning. It's now Window Cleaning Palm. He's got a really great channel. I'll also leave a link below. I want to give a shout out again to Stevo. I give him tons of shout outs. The guy's got an awesome channel, and he's only got 800 subscribers. I think he should have. A million, the guy, he's got good stuff. Check out Steve-O. And to our shirts, the reason we're wearing these shirts, window wash, he had a uh, spectacular, 
spectacular channel. He did, and he only had like 24 subscribers. We this, were two of them. We were two. We were both subscribed to Window Wash, and um, and he had a lot of bullying. There was a lot of guys on there just really picking this guy apart. We want you to come back. We really enjoyed your channel. Um, it was different than what anyone else was doing. You can go, I mean, you can see window cleaning montages on everyone's channel and you weren't doing that. You were showing what it's like on your day-to-day, -day, you know, trip to work and telling funny little stories and we really enjoyed it. We really enjoyed it. And I mean, there was one Sunday I think we laid in bed and watched every single one of your videos. And the, the one with the hedging, that we are trimming the hedges, yeah. I cried. I, I was laughing so hard. Literally cried. Because it was, you were just like naturally a funny and amusing person to watch. And we really enjoyed it. And so, and as you can see in this video too with the watch, if you're watching, you see that people are not always nice, even on our channel. And you know, you just take it with a grain of salt. So Gary, if you're watching, please come back, man. Uh, if people dislike every single video, you really, you could tell that you had a passion for what you were doing. You really enjoyed uploading them, and we really enjoyed watching them, and I think more people would too. If, if you had a show on TV, we would watch it religiously. We would. It's hilarious. It is, your channel was, was great. <laughs> Videos. <laughs> Right. Come back. If you see this, come back. Come back, Window Wash. We're we'll starting, support you. We're starting a campaign to bring back Window Wash. Oh. Alright guys, thanks for watching. We created a Facebook for Loop the Window Cleaner, so you guys can go there and like and comment and question. Uh, yeah. Alright, later. Miss <laughs> Meow?